This is Coded.org. Let's see what we're doing. Challenge face. <laughs> um, write a program using that uses rect, ellipse, fill to create a face out of shapes. An example is provided to the right, but you can make whatever you want. Draw a face that uses at least four shapes and two different colors. Fancy. So I'm going to be deeply boring and try to emulate their example. I'm going to throw down, let's see, fill, right? Because we have to pick the fill color first. Let me actually just do this. First, let's draw an ellipse 200, 200. Things to keep in mind. Why is it drawing in the center? There's a secret magical graph behind this. I can show the grid if I want. This is X, this is Y. So if I hover here, you see these little numbers? It draws from the center out for circles. And so 200, 200 is the exact center of this circle. Things to keep in mind with the graph, zero, zero is way up here. This is zero X, but up here is zero Y. So if you want something to move down, you have to increase the Y number. All right, all that being said, I'm thinking the eyes, maybe one here and one here. So 120, 120, let's try. Actually, let me do 150. I'm liking that for now. And now I'm gonna do the next one. Now this is gonna be easy because I know this one was, if the center line's 200, I went back 50. And so to emulate this, I wanna go plus 50 this time x however y needs to be the same right because y it's at the same level of y just more x okay that looks all right to me nose time nose is dead center ah, i should bump the eyes up a little bit so i'm going to change x to maybe i y i'm changing y i'm decreasing it to make it go up i like that a bit more and now this mouth so things to keep in mind with rectangles, it draws them from the top left. So the top left corner is where it starts to draw a rectangle. So I was hoping to have one here. So I would need to set it at 250, 250. Definitely not. Oh, Y should be the same, right? Because the Y, it's at the same level. And remember, I'm increasing Y to move down and definitely not. Oh, and see, I'm not following my own advice. It is the top right or top left of the rectangle. So I need a hundred to make a draw here. Cool. And now I want to pick my colors, which I guess, oh, wait, they had it bumped up a little bit. Mm. Cool. Now keep in mind with colors, guys, you have to put them above for them to work. Right? The computer runs this in order, so it draws the ellipse. If I have a color down here, it will switch to yellow, but after it's drawn everything. Now, if I put it way up here, everything will be yellow, which is not what I want. Oh, what is that, light blue? Then the nose apparently is red. Boom. And I think that's a light green. I should mention I'm red-green colorblind, so if this is all wrong, um, you're going to like it, because otherwise I'll, you'll film my class. <laughs> Just kidding. Uh, light green. Boom. But, uh, and hopefully you do something more exciting than this, right? Don't just copy them. Change up the colors. Make the eyes weird shapes. Uh, really anything. Make them bigger or smaller. Use squares for the eyes. I don't know. Have fun with this because it's boring to grade the same thing every time. But, yeah. Ta-da! Onward.